and welcome to Cox Local Edition on CNN Headline News. I'm Catherine Falk with Cox Communications. Thank you so much for joining us today. We have two wonderful guests, Barbara Freed, the chairman of the Sorensen Institute, and Vivek Kundra, who is the chief technology officer for Washington, D.C., and also a graduate of the political leaders program at the Sorensen Institute in 2007. Thank you both for joining us today. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Uh, Barbara, tell us about the Sorensen Institute. When was it founded and what is its mission? It was founded in 1993 by two gentlemen in Charlottesville, one an attorney, one a financial investment guru, uh, who felt that ethics was becoming a seriously missing component of politics. So the Sorensen Institute for Political Leadership was born. And in the 15 years, we have devoted our efforts toward classes and training for candidates, which is a short, intense program. And the main program is the uh, um, political leaders program, of which uh, Vivek is a graduate. And that throws together people from all over the uh, Commonwealth of different views, um, different backgrounds. And they get together, discuss issues, learn about real issues in uh, Virginia, and manage in a very bipartisan way to overcome not totally their differences, but to at least understand the other person's point of view. And so it's really about bringing political future leaders together to learn and, and engage in, in a future of bipartisanship. That's exactly it. And we also have a high school program and a college leaders program. So people interested in running for office have a special program. That's right. That's the um, candidate training program, which is a three-day, very intense program uh, compared to the uh, the candidate, the political leaders program, which runs all year on uh, weekends. And, and we have some very interesting people, and I think a wonderful result. One, uh, there's a state senator, uh, Mr. Notham, uh, who joined with three other freshmen, two from Republic, uh, the Republican side, two from the Democratic side, to try and bridge this aisles, and we'll okay. see what happens with that. Great. Vivek, tell us about your experience in the Sorensen Institute program. So the Sorensen Institute program uh, had fundamentally reshaped my philosophy on good government and uh, what it means to actually run a government versus um, politics. Uh, so a couple examples. One is when I was in the Commonwealth of Virginia serving as the Assistant Secretary of Commerce and Trade, the Sorensen Institute program helped me understand the vast diversity of this great commonwealth from Southside Virginia to Northern Virginia and all the issues and the great part about it is that we were able to travel all over the commonwealth to understand public policy issues that affect specific regions. And secondly, it prepared me in my current role to be able to really look at you know, the fundamental differences in terms of public policy and what elections really mean when it comes to governance and performance is neither a Republican nor a Democratic issue. It's a government issue. Great. And Barbara, I know that you have an important event coming up on March 20th. Tell our viewers about that and how they can find out more about the Sorensen Institute. It's being held at the Ritz-Carlton Pentagon City, and it honors the entire Virginia delegation serving in Washington, D.C., and uh, it's sorenseninstitute.org. Uh, Great. And we hope all of our viewers will be able to attend that wonderful event and learn more about your wonderful programs at the Sorensen Institute. Thank you very much. Thank you for joining us. And thank you for joining us on Cox Local Edition on CNN Headline News. Have a great day.